Madison. I'm from Buffalo, New York in the States. Um, I study at American University in Washington, DC. Uh, and I study neuroscience and I'm year four. Um, yep. Nice. <laughs> um, I'm Jordan. I'm from California near like San Francisco. And then I go to school at UC Santa Barbara. And I'm in my third year studying environmental science and I'm minoring in studio art. I'll start. Yeah. I picked New Zealand because I was really excited about the nature, everything here. Um, I really wanted to go hiking a lot. I knew there was like a lot of beautiful um, like trails and different uh, mountains that we could hike up and go to the top of. And I was really excited about that. <laughs> I feel like the scenery is just really beautiful here. And so I was excited to be outdoors all the time. Um, also just like, I I kind of thought about going to Europe, but I thought I'd definitely go back to Europe again in my life. But New Zealand was just something totally new and like totally across the world. And I was like, what am I gonna get a chance to live in a country like that again? So. Why not? <laughs> so, as you guys know, Jordan and I are flatmates. <laughs> we actually met each other uh, coming home from the airport. So, University of Auckland, when you fly into here, um, they offer us like a shuttle service. And so, Jordan and I took the same shuttle and we arrived at Carlaw and they said, okay, here are your keys. You guys are in the same room. So from day one, Jordan and I were friends. And then uh, after that, we just started attending Carla um, like events. the O week events. Yeah, yeah, like the student events and like the Carla domain, uh, walking through the domain tour. We did that and we met a lot of friends that way. So it's definitely a good way to like uh, get out and meet people like through school events and like your flat events. Cause that's really important to make a good group of friends before you start the semester. I would say my university back home is different in the way that we really do assignments and exams. Uh, I've noticed here at University of Auckland, we have a lot of our exams towards the end. We don't really have like mid-semester tests or like um, we'll have like tests towards the, the end of the quarter or like of the semester. Yeah, everything like sort of like middle. ramps up at the end instead of like yeah. being at like the, like, I don't know if the name for it. A mid, like instead of like midterms and just like assignments throughout, it all kind of like seems to compile at the end. Yeah, definitely. And like the fact that like finals here are worth like 50, 60, like 70% of your grade. Mm -hmm. It's very different. Like mine back at home would be like 30% or something like that. Like, I think um, the uni culture with the University of Auckland compared to my uni back home is definitely different because I go to a uni that has 8,000 people um, and here there are like 40,000 people that attend. So it's like really big and a lot of people on campus, which is like not something I'm used to. Also, I feel like it's like very casual and like people are friendly and like open here. So it's nice uh, to have that kind of culture. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would agree. It's just a lot of people on campus yeah. at once, which is just like crazy. Cause like I go to a kind of big school or I thought it was kind of big, like 20,000, but yeah, it's crazy. And I feel like I am always seeing like, I've never seen the same people. It's just always different people. Even in my classes that I have like the same people and it's like always new people. So classes are like so big. Favorite food? Meat pies? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Since coming to New Zealand, our favorite thing to eat is meat pies. Mm -hmm. We found this really good meat pie at Scratcher's Bakery. Um, 10 out of 10 would recommend. Yeah, yeah that's like the best so meat pie. Good. And we've had a lot since we've been here. Yeah. A lot. Um, we also love 